Welcome back to Mad Cardigan and our continuing playthrough of Fallout 4 Clear the Map. Well, Let's follow old Deacon here, works. see if he can uh, work some magic on that terminal. No. 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 And I think it's actually a master lock uh, terminal, so there was no bastards. way I'd be able to do it. The prototype's deeper inside. Someone left a rail sign here. Uh, Wasn't this guy, this poor old Roger. Yeah, we know. Poor dead bastard. We know. There he is, peekaboo. System is offline. Hello. Yeah, very offline. Oh, the giant. Oh, legendary. Nice. Always love a legendary roach. Easy kill, and it really doesn't affect the gear, as far as I can tell. Oh, of course, but it's a crap piece of armor. The sensitivity of my sensors clearly needs adjustment. I really wish you couldn't hear these guys through the floor and ceiling and everything. <laughs> Just like they're right beside Wait, you. See the box in the center of that rail sign? Mm-hmm. That means there's a cache nearby. It looks like Maven managed to hide something before it... Well, you know. Look around. Tinker <laughs> All right, let's see if we can do some fancy bat shooting here. Make sure I hit him. If we aim for the torso here, inevitably he's going to shoot at that wall. One down. I don't think you've ever. Oop. Not the greatest. Let's fuck up your day, Tack. There shouldn't be any courses in here, but if there are, just... Yeah, can we fight before you start monologuing here? Yep, see what I tell you? This thing can find a way to miss, it will. There you are. was not center mass that was above his head aiming it's ridiculous well that could piss you off excuse me deacon this is this terminal I don't know if I've ever looked at this before All the turrets are kind of blown up, so. Always grab the pistols or the weapons as well, because they have ammo in them. Another active terminal. We didn't have time to trip the defenses up ahead. Power them up, and we can give our friends a little... Ooh, I heard him. Now, let's turn these on. I think there's still some working some terminals present. here. How about it? Yep, we'll get them. Initiated. Well, that didn't do much. Overactive. Just taking a break. Oh, maybe the turret exploding knocked him over. That makes more sense than a synth taking a, a smoke break there. Alright, get me a little. Oh. Just. Boom. This gun's pretty powerful. Odd. My scanners must be malfunctioning. They are. I'm definitely not here. What do we have here? Take 
having more criticals is always good. I think you can get up to four plus the the normal one, so five, I think, total. Which would make sense because that's how many levels there are. That's brilliant. Just stating the obvious. All right, novice terminal. Come on, treat me well. Give me some craziness again. That one when I was hunting Kellogg took... Felt like hours. It was minutes, but still. On a novice terminal, it's ridiculous. Okay, eagle, eagle. That's it. Oh, bam. Second try, I love it. Seventy-eight percent shots. Like it. That box is probably guarding him. Two eighty-three percent misses. Man, I'm going to Vegas. As soon as the game's over, I'm out of here. Contact detected. Possibly. Percentages have just stopped meaning shit to this game. sliver of glass is what's helping him out there. What about that? Shoot through the concrete? <laughs> Got him. Every thigh shot. Gets him every time. Not every Slocum's Joe has a massive tunnel complex underneath it. We're entering a secret defense intelligence agency research lab. A place that Ooh, never... I see a generator. Existed. Gotta be a uh, fusion core over here. Yep. The prototype is locked up in the heart of the Always facility. use these things. Stealth capabilities. Fascinating. Whoever or whatever yeah, they gotta are, muffle those things. Here. Those folks are on a different level behind several closed doors. Makes no sense. If they return, I will be ready. Move dog meat. Minus one teddy bear. I really have to start looking for those bears too. I've probably skipped over several of them now. Oh, okay. Yes. More sneaky. I like it. And a globe, always necessary. <laughs> Worthless salon. <laughs> two in a row. <laughs> Can't do it on two missions in a row. No way. Hostile. You must be destroyed. Okay. Combat subroutine. Eliminating all hostiles. That's fan. Gone. Mm. I saw ya. Walls can't hide you anymore. Well, he's just hauling ass. He's like, I'm out of here. Please stand still. Must be behind a closed door over there or something. They're not moving. Chickens. Let's see if we can't do some fancy grenade work here. If they're all clustered together like that. Where did you go? I am right here. Lob it in. Oh, well, that guy was waiting for me. Okay. Did I get all three of them? Nice. Took some shots to the face while I was at it. Another combat shotgun. What was he doing with a shotgun? Stanley, Salas and Grote, Supreme Lex. Open says me. So clever, Deacon. The doors in this game, just like the old Skyrim doors, very, uh, very intricate. So Tommy Whispers didn't make it out. He died protecting our secrets. 
Let me see. There. Tommy, Tommy likes would leather. Have his hand cannon. Don't let its size fool you. Never do. Why are you giving this to me? Our best agents carry special ordnance made by Tinker Tom. He's... Well, you'll know when you meet him. Call this gun a vote of confidence. Tinker Tom is the reason I'm here. Grab Carrington's prototype. You turn that over to Desdemona, and she'll have to let you into our merry band. Nice. Okay. There's an prototype. elevator at the end of the hall. It should be Stealth a hell of a lot easier all, uh, fighting the chrome domes on this side of the minefield. Didn't do him a whole lot of good. Oh, hazmat suit. Always good to keep one of these on hand. Just in case. Especially if you're doing this like a survival mode or anything like that. Because uh, rad storms pop up out of nowhere. You know, we're going to end up going to the glowing sea eventually and one of these suits it has no armor but it will make you pretty much immune you can either do that you can do power armor or you can do a whole lot of rat away radix and rat away Damn jangles hate monkeys Lots of cryo mines. You know, I don't think I've ever used a cryo mine. Why would I want to freeze something instead of blow it up? Uh, these railings. Bane of my existence here. Let's wait just a second. Patience is a virtue. And eat it. There you go. Hello. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Definitely using stealth. That's all I use. Oh, come on. <laughs> okay, okay. End of the line. Just power up the elevator. All right. Mr. Bossy. Uh, the elevator. What are these turrets? Which ones do these control? Deactivate. Are these the ones upstairs? No. I didn't see any other turrets in here. Or the uh, one that was maybe blown up again. Going Sorry, dog meat. You can catch up. Catch the next one. I remember the first time I played this, I thought this was a glitch. I didn't see the bookcase thing there. I just thought the door opened to darkness. Probably sat in that elevator for five minutes before I figured out what the heck was going on. Because I have a very large brain. Okay, meet Deacon. Nope, I can hear those turrets still rolling. The little gears going. First, there's like two levels of these stupid things, and of course, are behind all these little railings that you are sure to shoot. Detected. No, you didn't detect shit. Okay, I was expecting a rail hit there. Yep. Yeah, there's no way they were going to deactivate those right off the bat. Damn. No, oh, shit, he snuck up on me. Damn. But you're in the diner down there, having coffee or whatever the hell a synth drinks. Oil. Oh, damn. Woo. Uppercut. Man, he's trying to give me a prostate again. Not today, pal. Hi, 
We got what we came for. Let's split up and meet back at the catacombs. Bye. See you soon. This is funny. Usually, um, Deacon will walk out and just start stepping on mines out here. He'll blow him up and he'll sit down for a minute. You know, just kind of shake it off. Landmines for babies. Man, I can see stuff for miles in buildings hidden with this new update vision. When you get that penetrator perk later on, that is really going to help. If you can already see them through the walls and get a bead and a percentage shot on them, that's pretty good. There's a perk later on that lets you shoot through cover. It's pretty awesome. Dog mean to always find something. He wants to show me the tin can he dug up in this apocalyptic world. Okay, now I gotta run all the way back down to get uh, these underground dwellers' acceptance into their little secret club, which I don't even care about. I'm more of a brotherhood guy, I like the the tech and all that kind of stuff. Not so much their ideals, but I'm here for my son. I don't and care since one way or the other. Up, put me on his shoulder and blast but I lied to Desdemona. I'm sure as hell not giving it, it up for him. Time. Amazing, right? That's one word for it. Deacon told me you single-handedly... Charisma gear. Everybody avert your eyes. They okay, secured no, Carrington's prototype, disabled a minefield, and wiped out 100 Gen 1s. So is any of that true? 200. Every word he said was true. And then some. If you didn't have the Damn prototype, it. I'd think you're both lying through your teeth. See? Didn't sound Just like a failure. Just like I said, boss. I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. But instead, just the two of you cleared out Glory would have walked in there with a minigun. You'd be insane not to sign him up, Des. You've certainly made an impression on Deacon. He's never spoken about or lied about anyone so highly before. Welcome well, to the real lie-worthy. Agent. Yes, I want your ballistic Glad weave. Aboard. It seems we're very lucky to have you. So you're in. Now we need to know what to call you. Secrecy keeps us alive. Code names are a part of that. So what's yours? Now this is funny. You can uh, have any suggestions. There's no. a secret. It doesn't work uh, like Code that. name that you can your have life, if you just won't answer name, her. Your choice. Let me. I used think. to go with Bull's Eye all the time. Take your time. Since my I don't name want to go. So name. fantastic. Code names aren't optional. All agents need to keep their identities secret to protect themselves and those close to them. And then let her choose. I really don't want to choose. Suit yourself. We'll call you Wanderer. Seems fitting. Your first official it order is, is to deliver you Dr. Carrington his prototype game. and see if he can use another pair of hands. No but first, Wanderer. it's time to meet the rest of the gang. The location of our HQ is one of our most tightly guarded secrets. So be careful coming in or out. Old Deke. You never can tell when you're being watched. Ah, could have used the, one of those two wasted savants on that. This is it. It may lack the amenities of the switchboard. But it's safe, and we've taken precautions not to be surprised again. Things are chaotic right now, so there's plenty for you to do. All right, you bucket of joy, Carrington. Horrible bedside manner. Listen up, Desdemona told me this to give you this. An extraordinary feat to recover this, but Deacon. that's hardly the point. Without a lick of training idiot. and us knowing hardly anything about you, Des has invited you to join to I have your damn prototype, man. It would have been nice if she had consulted with her second-in-command. 
But what's done is done. <sighs> Since you're here now, we might as well put you to work. Cut to the chase. One of our field agents, Old Man Stockton, needs help with the runaway synth. H-222. So headquarters, as always, puts out the fires that others You guys really have to work on those names. Themselves. Paranoid old bat won't even tell us the problem. He insists that we get our intel from a dead drop. Since he our people too. What's his name? H-222. And maybe he did the other dozen times he's made our agents jump through these unnecessary hoops. The dead drop is a mailbox with a rail sign on it. It's a common means of communication for us, so keep an eye out for them. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper countersign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. You can trust me with You're this. You're lucky. That was a speech I'll get it check. Done. You sound rather convincing, actually. Stockton is a prominent businessman at Bunker Hill. The dead drop will be near there. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. Okay, sounds simple enough. We got their nice little uh, wine cellar that they live in here. <clears throat> Here's my man. This guy's got all the good stuff. Including one gun that I'm uh, kind of interested in right now. I can't remember how much it costs. The sensor sweep says you're clean. Hooray! We're bug free. Ray indeed. Yeah, that's great. Not so fast, man. Okay, have you eaten anything out there? Because if you have, they got you. Who's got me? Yeah, I've eaten food. Squirrel bits and the like. Oh, I knew it. The Institute has these tiny microscopic robots in the food, man. And they report back. Tom, that's rubbish. You just don't get it, Carrington. The Institute is in your blood. That's a lot to process. Please, don't believe a word of this bollocks. Don't okay, encourage okay. him. If you really want to be safe, let me give you a little shot. There's, there's the motor. Says no one has to, but it will kill those little robots. There's battery acid in that serum of yours. You can't nuke an omelet without irradiating some eggs. You ready to shoot up? Yeah, sure, why not? Hit me, Tom. Yeah. I've never looked into this, but... I know this almost kills you, but I wonder if it gives you any benefit whatsoever. Now you're encouraging him. Hey, you, you get it, man. I make things around here. You, you go and do, you do whatever. And come back and I will set you up. Let's see what you got. Make yourself comfortable and prepare to Should be Should give me a discount for letting me stick or letting you stick me with that needle. Okay, he's got the standard stuff. That's the one I'm looking for. A silencer on a sniper rifle. So you can take that off and put it on any other one if you get one. But right now, you know, that one's not too bad in, on itself or for its uh, own use, you know. Its perk isn't that great. Usually when I use sniper rifles with scopes, it's a manual shot because the percentages are so low at a good distance. But, okay, let's see. Can we... So I'm still carrying all these damn pistols. Recoup some of this money. And now, since I have that, I don't need that pipe uh, sniper rifle anymore. Tida. Just a little uh a little shopping going on here. I'm sorry this takes a minute. Especially me trying to do math. You're lucky it's as short as it is.
save up some shotgun shells. Since I only use some auto shotguns, you don't need this many of them. See, he almost killed you with that. I can't even sleep there because that, you know, on the mattress. This place actually has a lot of stuff in it, a lot of goods that you can you can loot. Some ammo, meds, stuff like that. So that you can then sell right back to him. take circuit boards are you injured it's a wonder you just watched him inject me that crap you know I'm injured Put your armor back on. Rule number one in this game. Now you can fast travel right into this room instead of having to run through the church every time. Let's scoot back to the house for a minute. Take a little power nap because my health is garbage right now. Just an hour. Yeah, full health. No problem. We've got my specialty locker for stuff I don't use. Not a pistol guy. By the end of this playthrough, this damn thing's going to be bursting. Okay, let's lighten the load. These things do have a little bit of weight to them if you're carrying around 50 grenades. Take a tom. Hook me up with that rifle. See that? thousand resistance against rads always good not life or death in a, in a regular playthrough as long as you have some drugs with you you'll be fine but Let's see what we can't do to this gun real quick like it's as good as it's getting damage wise Short stock it. Remember that increases the shots in the vats. Gives you a little more on the range. And it looks a little bit cooler. I'm always a sucker for the, the reflex sight. Gotta get the dot. Yeah. And never, never want the bayonet. I don't think I've ever used that bayonet. Oh boy, more enclave paint. All of it's looking the same now. Calibrated, powerful. Okay, till I get to that 50 caliber, that's uh, that's pretty good. Okay, since I use this one for manual shooting, I don't have to worry about that. Oh, look at that paint job. That's what I'm talking about right there. That really stands out. Make sure we're all got our favorites in there. 
Okay. Ooh, fancy. Okay. My aim is a little wobbly. It's to be expected. Always a good idea to good idea to hide before you move. Before you fast travel. Especially going to Drumlin Diner. You never know what shit you're gonna step in. Yeah, I don't need to go underground. I can go above because we're running north. I'm gonna go find this old man Stockton. Rads, rads, rads. See, this would be a perfect place to put on that hazmat suit, but I'm more worried about armor right now. But just to show you. Since I'm right near the church, we may be okay for a minute. Normally, unless I was in the glowing sea, wouldn't even put this thing on, but... See, those rads are barely affecting you. The rad storms aren't horrible. Unless you're just really counting rads, like counting calories. It's uh, only when like the lightning strikes, you know, does it really get a hold of you. Figure out where I am. I always get confused when I'm in the city like this until I see like a landmark I recognize. Oh boy, there we go. There we go. See what I tell you. I'm wearing a hazmat suit. Wonder if I can. He went over there. What's that? That's a grenade. Okay, got maybe one of them. I don't know if he sees me yet. Watch this. I'll shoot this pole. Whoa! What the heck is on fire? Do I have a Molotov or something? Interesting little mechanic there. Okay, I hear robots. Is that a vertebird? It's the uh, Brotherhood's already running around somewhere. Once they enter the, the fray, they just randomly show up in vertebrates and inevitably get shot down by whoever they're fighting and usually land right on top of your head. So, gotta be careful. Watch out for those vertebrates. And also, sometimes the, uh, the bad gang, the gunners, can also have uh, vertebrates too, so. Don't just run up thinking they're your allies. Until you've checked them out. Trust but verify, right? Alright. A little trip to Bunker Hill. She's just standing out here in a rad storm. Caravan or raider? Hazmat guy. I'm here on my own. Freelance, huh? Alright. Come on in, but no gunfire. Market's open. You can do as much trading as you like. Cool, thanks. Guys are awfully trusting. Alright. The monument. It's looked better. Hi, I'm Meg. Hey, Meg. I'm City. I want to talk to some vendors here. So let's go ahead and get to business hours. And you'll make sure that that rad storm is passed. Hi, I'm Meg. You new to the hill? Oh, no. For 10 caps, I can give you the tour. Nobody knows the place I will put you all through another, uh, another tour. Not interested. <laughs> You're a loss. You kids are shakedown artists around here. Dog beat found another can. Okay, get your charisma gear on for vendors as well, if you can remember to do it, because uh, it does affect the price. 
for buying and selling. Don't steal that fan. I've done that before and everybody Load tries to kill you. Bath? I'll buy anything you don't need and sell everything you do. You have any paying work? Yeah, I have something. It ain't easy though. Caravan is just love swapping tall tales. But I've heard one story enough times, there's got to be some truth to it. Lay it on. Apparently, the northern road goes straight through an old military training yard that's just crawling with a horde of feral ghouls. And that's cutting into my bottom line. So you take care of that, and maybe I can throw a few caps your way. Sounds like a deal. I'm not doing the job for chump change. Oh, there I'm tired of mercs blowing this off. Are ferals really that scary? Yeah, they are. Fine. Call it 175 caps. Can I get an orange? Sounds like you need me a lot more than I need you on this. Clearing Ooh. that road benefits everyone. I can probably get Kessler to chip in, let's say, 225 caps. I ain't gonna push it. care of your feral problems. It's not Great. about the money, though, but... If you wanna stock up first, you never know when one of my knickknacks will keep you alive. Excuse me. I fixed up most of what's here myself, so it's all guaranteed. <laughs> Unless you need to return it. <laughs> Guaranteed, sure. unless you need to look. return See it. something you like, buy it. My stock moves fast. Always check for their special items. Wastelander's friend. Eh, limb damage. It's an automatic, so... Or I think it is, anyway. Or you can make it one. Uh, that's not horrible. See, that movement speed, but that costs like twice as much as the other... And maybe a heavier piece of armor. Yeah, she's got nothing I need. She's got a napkin. It's always useful. Do, 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 do. Get rid of the ammo I'm not going to use. I think I just picked up, yeah, a couple extra drugs here and there. Um, standard three to five, you know, on those. Thanks for the money. Trash can Carla's got her own uh, little setup here as well. But this is where I leave you. <laughs> Before we go find that dead drop. It's just right around the corner, but make sure I put my armor back on. And thank you for joining me and Mad Cardigan. And we will see you in the next one. For Fallout 4, clear the map.